Now we all know that open water swimming is getting bigger and bigger each year. And the norm when it comes to open water swimming is that you focus on long, slow swimming. But let's shake that up a little. The possibilities are endless when it comes to open water swimming. So let's take a look at what you can do with standard training aids. I'm Sean from Simply Swim. And let's talk about how to be imaginative with our open water swims. Kickboards. Now kickboards are an integral part of any swimmer's kit, but not a lot of people use them in the open water. Kickboards can help improve and build up your kick in the open water, just like they do in the pool. Yes, now you don't want to be holding on to your kickboard all the time you're swimming, but that's easy to remedy. With some string or rope and a carabiner, you can trail the kickboard behind you, so then you can focus on your stroke or your kick. Pool boys. Now most open water swimmers wear wetsuits when training, of course this gives you buoyancy but where possible try to swim in open water without a wetsuit this builds up your overall swimming strength and helps you deal with the colder waters doing this will push you further than if you were to wear a wetsuit and to keep your legs buoyant in the water you can use old faithful the pool boy swim snorkels snorkels are a great training aid to have no matter what level swimmer you are just like when you wear them in the pool it makes you pull focus on either your stroke or your kick which is going to help in your overall swimming game in the open water just remember to keep your sight you don't want to wander of course hand paddles now this bit of kit comes in all shapes and sizes each size has a benefit smaller hand paddles allow you to develop an understanding of what an effective catch should feel like and larger hand paddles work like a weight machine in the water and this is going to help build up your strength using hand paddles in your open water training will really help enhance your stroke pattern and how much power you put into it water bottles it goes without saying no matter the exercise hydration is key of keeping you on top of your game this goes for open water swimming as well so just like the kickboard attach a piece of string and a clip or carabiner that way when you need a drink it's right there in the water with you and there we have it that's our bonus footage now you've got your kickboard pool boy snorkel hand paddles and water bottle let's put them into practice First, start with a warm-up. Do one lap of your course, starting at a steady pace and increasing it every 75 strokes. Your preset should be as follows. Kick to the first buoy and swim around the course back to the start at a 70% pace. Then pull to the second buoy with medium hand paddles, then swim the rest of the course focusing on your stroke. Your next lap will be a max effort using the kick ball to the first boy, kick to the second boy, and then using your pool boy to the third boy, then a full stroke to the start of the course. Then on the last lap, steady swim to the first boy, max effort to the second boy, and finish the course using a kickboard. Now your main set will consist of two large laps, max effort for 50 strokes, then a steady swim for 50 strokes, and repeat until you're halfway through the course, then you can rest for a minute. And then once you've rested, repeat. Once that's done with, have a nice, slow, steady pacing lap to cool you down. And that's our open water swim video in a nutshell. Got any tips for open water swimming? Share them with the world in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe.